you need to install Python with both Conda and PIP and have the ability to include any Conda environment in your Jupyter Notebook, we've come to the right place. First thing we do is go to the Anaconda website. We want to install individual edition. Like most of you in 2021, my Windows laptop is 64-bit, so I installed a 64-bit version. Once that's done, we go through the install steps. I'll just install for my local user. Frankly, this is the easier choice, and it saves you a lot of headaches with permissions when installing packages in the future. And also know you don't need to add it to your path variable in this step. That will be done for you later, so leave it unchecked for now. Through the magic of fast forward, we're all finished now. Next, I'm going to search for the Anaconda prompt in Cortana and pull it up. Then I'm going to Conda init PowerShell. This allows PowerShell to use all the Conda and Python commands. Now there are a lot of packages not available in Conda Forge, so we'll install pip as well. The most direct way to do that is go to this website and copy the get pip script. We just have to select all with control A, copy with control C, and then paste into a local file. We'll save that file as get-pip.py. Then in PowerShell, we'll write python get-pip.py and boom, it's installed. Soon. Yes, yours may take a little longer unless you are also living in fast forward. Finally, I want to install this little package. NB Conda Kernels makes it so that your Jupyter Notebooks can access any Conda environment kernel. It's very handy and installing now saves you the regret when you go to try to use Jupyter later in your environment. We are all done. Thank you and happy coding. I'm your host, Some Random Dude. I'll see you next time.